Hello again. Let's talk about frequencies, God frequency or the love frequency because it's important. That's when you are at these type of frequencies that things happen. I learned that from Dr. Lasko who is an OBGYN and he was tested at Stanford. There were some cancer cells that was, were put in a petri dish and he was meditating on them and when he was at a certain frequency these cancer cells stopped growing. Also there were some uh, sick cells that he protected from antibiotic. When he had his energy, his frequencies around those cells, the antibiotics could not reach these cells. So what are these frequencies? Well, look at the pictures that follow. Those are frequencies that uh, we are in whenever we do something in our life. It's just random frequencies and you can see there's different uh, different frequencies. One is from an electroencephalogram, one is from a heart rate variability, one is an electromyogram. They're all kind of random. Now look at this one. You see on this one how synchronized they were. When Dr. Lasko was resonating at those frequency, which he called the love frequency, it's when he could stop the growth of cancer. And I believe that's also the frequencies we need to have when we want to attract something in our life. So how do we get to that frequency? It's a very relaxed frequency. Imagine yourself being just neutral at a beach, in a park, in a beautiful, serene place in a place where you feel comfortable, you feel safe, and just in a beautiful environment. Enjoy that feeling of being there. So practice on that. And next time I'll show you how we're gonna go step by step from that love frequency onto attracting and getting what we want in our lives. I'll see you soon.